Morning, smushy face. Morning, Rose. Doesn't care. Hey guys, as you can probably tell, again, <laughs> this morning I am feeling a little drained. Um, uh, I don't know why they, they've been doing it recently, but um, at four in the morning, um, Riley was barking and stuff, and um, like Jason went downstairs and stuff, but they were making so much noise that it like shook me awake. Um, and I really wanted to get a whole night's sleep because yesterday I was up, you know, like most of the night. Um, and I just couldn't get back to sleep once I'd woken up, and like that happens to me quite a lot. Um, and so yeah, I've been up since four in the morning, it's about seven o'clock. Um, I really, really want to go to a hot yoga class today, it's at quarter past ten. And I'm just hoping that I've got the energy to do it, because I haven't slept properly again, hello. Yeah, I've just been sitting in my dressing gown. <laughs> kind of editing slash reading blogs and stuff don't judge me okay like <laughs> i've got dark circles and everything because of the sleep today i was planning to try and do a little trip to brighton to like stay you know have a proper trip there but i'm not sure if that's gonna happen so yeah play it by you i guess you know oh we really want to go to the cinema yeah hey guys seat belt <laughs> um it's Oh my god, it's half one. Um, I went to yoga this morning, which was really good. After you guys saw me last, I went back to sleep. Um, and then I woke up, rushed to, road, <laughs> rushed to yoga. We're going to go and get some lunch. And Jason's um, like taking us to somewhere. It's like a surprise. <laughs> we wanted to go to a kind of like um, pub garden place. So yeah, and then later we're going to the cinema to see Mr. Holmes. Oh, it's so hot in here. Oh, it's really warm today, it's proper summer, England, English summer day, which is quite cold to most of you watching probably. So we're at Amnina and Carter at, uh, sorry what was it called? Wet. Wait. 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 It's really pretty here. Is it? It looks like a little village. And yeah. there's a little river. Cute. So hungry. Got a cocktail. What did I get? I got the thorny cow. <laughs> which is vodka. I don't usually like vodka but it's nice. So I got a burger. I haven't had a burger for a little while. Sweet potato fries. And then, uh, what kind of steak is that? Sirloin. Sirloin steak. And um, there's ribs. <laughs> I like this one. <laughs> Do it again. Oh, thank you. Hey guys, so it's about, God, it's like 6.45. <laughs> so sorry, today's been, um, yeah, today's, today's been a funny one. Um, it was a bit of a crazy-ish morning, like before I started filming and everything. Yeah, then we ate, okay, <laughs> is this really boring? I'm just like recapping everything that I've done. Um, and then, of course, I've been editing <laughs> and kind of chilling. And at the moment, I'm watching um, Pixie Moo's video of Joan Collins. And it's really interesting and it's just making me feel like playing with makeup. So I'm just like sitting at my little mirror. Well, good mirror. Um, if you guys have wondered, my mirror is from Home Sense. Um, and I don't know if they sell it anymore, uh, I don't know if it's a one-off, but keep an eye out. HomeSense have really nice mirrors and loads of cool homeware stuff, this is not flattering. <laughs> so, um, um, earlier I was, like, looking at some of my video comments on my, on my, um, main channel, and, <laughs> you know the video where, like, the body image thing is mentioned? Oh no, actually, I think it was in a different video. Um, and a girl said, commented, uh, Oh, I saw the I saw that comment that guy said about your body. I thought you've put weight on too, but you still look good. And it's <laughs> and it's like I totally appreciate you know that you you're saying that I look nice. But what annoys me is the but. It's like you put weight on, but like why is it a bad thing to put weight on? <laughs> oh, it's really annoying. I just wish it was just like oh, anyway. It just doesn't need to be addressed. I'm just playing around. We're gonna go. Oh, we were gonna go and see Mr. Holmes, but it's on at a really weird time, so we're gonna go and see Knock Knock instead with 
um, Keanu Reeves and we saw the trailer to it not long ago and I thought it looked shit <laughs> and I was like oh what a stupid film but um, nothing else is on and it's it should be entertaining I'll let you guys know what we think um, I like a good kind of psychological weird film and it is it looks like it's like that and I like Keanu Reeves to be honest <laughs> I think I used to have a crush on him in Matrix um, I'm just gonna play around with some like makeup and then I'll be back hmm so I've ended up with some sort of like bridal makeup <laughs> no not as nice I mean it's just like neutral but I just wanted to put some brown on my eyes I don't know I like playing <laughs> Oh god, this is going to be such a boring vlog. I'm going to show you actually what I got from Primark the other day. I got quite a lot of underwear, so I don't know whether to show that. Okay, so I got this, um, which is a hooded um, top. You know those just kind of workout tops. I see them a lot in Sweaty Betty and stuff, and they're bloody expensive. So um, I found this one, and it was £8. So good in their workout range, so... Um, yeah, that's really cool for like to and from yoga and stuff. I got quite a few pairs of underwear. Oh my god <laughs> Frenchies I just I quite like Primark underwear. I mean why not and the friends t-shirt that I was wearing yesterday I love it. I don't know where I've put it. I think it's in the other room or something and uh, I just like shoved it off But yeah, that was about eight pounds as well I think and it's a good like lounge around the house top so, oh, I'll show you guys as well what I got from Selfridges. So I got my Bitch Perfect lipstick, as I said. So I wanted to try out their skincare range, like I said. Um, so I got the cream cleanser. And I, I got the one for kind of, I guess it's kind of normal to oily skin as opposed to, you know, drier skin and anti-aging line. Um, then I got the all-in-one, I think this is like a daily moisturiser. Um, and then a moisturising milk in light and they were so inexpensive, I'm so happy, £7.95, £7.95, £4.95, amazing and I was watching, um, I totally, like Sally Hughes' name just left my brain completely and I would just have to go and like research to make sure that I got her name right again, which I, I like watched her for ages, I don't know why I forgot, anyway, the video with Caroline Hirons and Sally Hughes and um, yeah they were talking about skincare and stuff and I think Sally Hughes said that the Muji skincare line is supposed to be good so I just thought I would try it out. So Jason's come out of the room that I banish him to. If anyone wondered, this is what my <laughs> this is what my um, dressing table looks like most of the time. Pretty messy. Um, I'm loving trying out these Sunday Rari oils. I love oh I love Luna and Juno. I'm not very keen on Artemis, even though it's made for people with oily skin. And I'm not very keen on this either. It made me look orange. Dogs are eating something. <laughs> hey Riley just made an iced coffee because we leave in oh, I don't know about 40 minutes or something um, so I have all I'll have all the food then so we're at the cinema I forgot to <laughs> vlog in the car journey hoping the film's good should we get popcorn this time because we didn't eat it last time yeah it's a small one okay yeah but they always just give us the large first world problems sweets this is what I got Oh, what are you making? You'll see. <laughs> He's fandangoing around with tape. I love that tape. I've always loved it. We walked out of the film. It was so bad. <laughs> um, I really wouldn't recommend going to see it unless you like shit films. Oh, we went to see it as well because it was 8.1, was it? On yeah. IMDb. Which usually gives us a good indication of stuff. But no, like Keanu Reeves was really uh, <laughs> difficult to watch. Oh, I should be going to see Insidious tomorrow. So hopefully that will kind of make up for it. <gasps> there was a trailer for, what was it? Um, Sinister 2, which I really like the first Sinister film. And another scary looking one called The Gallows. Loads of scary films coming up. But they should come out in October because it's scare fest. <laughs> Did you get scared at the trailers? No. I bet you did. I don't get scared at <laughs> them. Yeah. Well, it's all happening in real life. What do you mean? Like, yeah, a big man comes up behind me and he fucking knocked down. 
No, because what if he's a ghost? Are he's some sort of spirit and then you can't knock him out? I don't believe in ghosts. Yeah, but it's too late by then. You just know that they are real. What's the worst that's going to happen? I'll die. It's not scary. Yeah. Well, I'm sure dying is scary, but that's Yeah, it. it's too late what by then. What else can they do to me? Yeah, it's true. But they could really, like, mess you up. How? And then you could, you'd live messed up. Yeah. Special Santa. So smart. <laughs> yeah. You're really proud of it. <laughs> Aren't you, Frank? Frank? Franklin? <laughs> no, I'm not. I want to go to bed and Jason's just making a party hat for Franklin and he won't stop. <laughs> oh, what's happening? <laughs> I'm making Franklin a party hat. <laughs> I've been waiting for like 10 minutes and then I realised that we're still making it. How's the water? Party hat. <laughs> I made a gnome hat. It's not, it's not done Franklin yet. the gnome. Franklin the gnome. Franklin, are you excited for your new duck hat? <laughs> no. Daddy likes dressing you up in things. Ready? Okay, this is the little hat. Oh, this is pretty good actually. Looking right. Oh, mm, quite the craftsman. Yeah. <laughs> it's at the end of a condom. <laughs> yeah, do you want to see in front or behind the ears? Yeah. Yeah, Franklin, I like your new style. We yeah, um, model it for N and K. <laughs> No. Uh, uh, uh. Wait. Good boy. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, so just in bed. Oh, got this horrible thing here. Anyway. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, just doing my sign off. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I wanted to. Let's get comfy. Um, I wanted to share with you <laughs> that I think a highlight of my day today was. When we were going into into the film, I dropped. <laughs> I had to put a ice cream and then dropped my spoon on the floor, and I was like, "Oh fuck!" A guy that works at the cinema was walking past and saw that I dropped it, and he was like, "Oh, like what's wrong?" <laughs> like came over to us and stuff, and we were like, "Oh, nothing." Like you know what you're like. For, uh, straight away, when someone comes over to you, it's like, "Oh no, no we're fine." Um, and he was like, "Oh, did you drop your spoon? Should we just go and get you another one?" And I was like, "Oh," <laughs> I was like, "I didn't know what to say." And he was like, "Oh no, it's fine. I'll bring one more to your. I'll come and find you in your seat in the cinema and bring you another spoon, <laughs> like from the front of the cinema." How sweet! It's just really nice. Sometimes humans are nice, and that's good because sometimes you lose all hope. <laughs> so let's hope that he gets good karma. So, um, I will catch you guys tomorrow. I can't believe how close it is to the end of Loon now. It's gone really quick. Parts of it have gone slow and parts of it have gone really quick, but overall I feel like it's gone quick. Um, in case you guys, well, I don't know if anyone cares, <laughs> but at the moment I'm reading, like I read before I sleep and I'm reading Station Eleven and then also kind of um, Caitlin, no, Catelyn, Caitlin? Caitlin Moran's book, um, How to Be a Woman, and it's quite good so far. Um, anyway, see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and give it a like if you liked it. Bye!